Hello and welcome to Bro Duel. This time we have alternate actors. The mod has been made by Iceberg, the same author who brought us placeable statics and buyable paintings. Similar to those mods, alternate actors isn't your typical Skyrim mod and gives the player more control over NPCs in Skyrim. It introduces two new spells into the game that you'll automatically learn when the mod is installed. The complete spell lets you take full control over any humanoid NPC in the game. The way it works is simple, you just need to use the spell on any other NPC and then after the loading screen ends, you'll become the character. It isn't just a controlling spell, you actually become the character, with their inventory, their skills, their level and everything else. Certain things are still the same, for example certain undroppable items and shouts are shared between the Dragonborn and the new NPC. But because combat, interaction, skills, levelling up and everything else works, you can essentially play the game as that NPC if you wanted to. Your original character also acts as an essential follower, so you can keep them with you at all times. Or you can tell them to wait where they are while you go adventuring as your new character, and if you die it will reload your last save as it normally would. If you ever decide you've had enough, you can use a spell to change back to your original character at any time. As of right now, there's a few limitations and bugs to deal with. For example, if you use the spell on a female NPC, then you'll have to enter sex change into the command console during the loading screen. Then you need to close the race menu to complete the process. Certain bugs also lead to slightly amusing results when NPCs switch races during the process, but the author says he's determined to work his way through them. The simple version of the spell also lets you take control of animals as well as humanoid NPCs. It works in the same way, but you only control their movement, so you can't use them in combat or for anything else. But nevertheless, it's fun to run around as a mammoth or a fire giant added by the monster mod. As of right now, the mod's essentially a template for what's to come. The author has big plans to make the most of having the ability to take control and play as any NPC in the game. In the future, he plans to release a lore-friendly version that only works on allies, as well as make quests that utilise the mod's functionality. He also wants to expand into animal combat and of course straighten out any bugs. You'll also eventually be able to use the spells to take control of an NPC and then use the race menu to change their appearance permanently. So if that's something you're interested in, then be sure to add it to your trackings list. And overall, the mod has potential and it's definitely something we haven't seen before, so we think you should definitely try it out or keep an eye on it. And be sure to leave an endorsement if you enjoy the mod, and thanks for watching.